Good morning. This is Richard Katman. I'm an artist, landscape architect, photographer. My studio is located at 24 Water Street, Holliston, Massachusetts. My website is www.richardkatman.com, K-A-T-T-M-A-N, and you may at any time uh, Google images. Uh, again, the spelling is K-A-T-T-M-A-N. This is a preview of a show that I have coming up um, starting February 28th and ending March 24th in 2013 <clears throat> at Fountain Street Fine Art Gallery in Framingham, Massachusetts at 59 Fountain Street. These paintings are large abstracts that I've worked on over the last uh, couple of years. Uh, they are basically six feet by six feet and run through the range of colors, red, yellow, blue, orange, green, violet, uh, yellow, ochre, burn umber, and black. Uh, so I will take you through a quick tour of the paintings and a little explanation of some of what they're about. So please enjoy the tour. This painting is titled Journey. It is uh, comprised of uh, basically red, uh, cadmium red, uh, but has marks in uh, cobalt blue, uh, cadmium green, and uh, it's quite heavily splashed in some locations with white to give it movement and motion. The next painting in the series is titled West of the Sun. And this is a bright painting in cadmium yellow with uh, perhaps uh, burnt umber marks from figure drawing as abstract marks, again, that give it motion and, and feeling. Uh, there are some beautiful blues and some uh, pinks and greens as well in this painting. The next painting in the series is titled <coughs> West, of, West of the Ocean. Uh, this is based on uh, spending time in Little Compton, Rhode Island, uh, seeing the ocean there and uh, enjoying the shore. The next painting in the series is untitled. Uh, this is the orange painting in the series. And again, these are some of the marks and colors comprising this painting. The next painting in the series is uh, predominantly green. Uh, this is a long view of that painting. It's quite intensive in its uh, marks and use of color. Lots of yellow, lots of red, pink, oranges splattered throughout, uh, white. Uh, there's quite a bit of action in this in this painting. I try to uh, make these paintings quite uh, joyous uh, in their feeling. This is a painting that I've titled Passion. It's predominantly violet with uh, yellow ochre uh, gold marks in the, in the painting. And these are uh, some of the details of uh, some of the marks in that painting. The next painting in the series is titled Desert. This painting was completed after a flight from uh, California to Boston, I could see the uh, Arizona landscape from 30,000 feet in the plain. And this is my a memory of that flight. Uh, I could see, of course, the desert sands, but also um, the rock uh, mountains and the agricultural fields and irrigation uh, systems that are, in, that are in place there. These are some of the paint marks and colors used throughout this painting. It's predominantly a yellow, uh, a raw sienna with some beautiful cobalt blues and greens. Last but not least in the series is this uh, painting, which is to me is quite mysterious. The lighting in this location is not the best, so I'll try to uh, uh, show you some of the details in this painting without uh, being blinded by the light, so to speak. Burn umber, uh, pure black, 
uh, but comprised of some mysterious numbers and uh, odd colors in the blue and green range. So that's a very quick tour of the work. Uh, you're invited cordially to see the show. Look me up on the web and thank you and good morning.